So I, I distinctively remember sitting on the couch and talking to God and saying, you know, I don't ask you for very much. You've given me everything I could ever ask for, but I, I need a direction, you know? I need help. We are becoming members. Well, we couldn't figure out what we were going to do with my 13-year-old um, daughter. She um, was being bullied um, at school and pushed in lockers. She never last year wanted to go um, to school. Every day was a struggle um, for her. Um, mentally, physically, it made her ill. And I knew we had to change something as her mother. I knew something needed to be done. So I texted my neighbor, Melissa Mason. For the last year, she had told me how amazing she loved the, her kids' school. Everything just kind of came together, you know? And with the school was starting Monday. This was Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, the beforehand. I mean, if it wasn't for Mr. Zeal, he put everything within three days. You know, who does that for a complete stranger? You just feel like family right away, instantly. And I've, I've loved that about St. Matthew's. Absolutely loved it. And then that's when, you know, he's like, you can take these, this, that class, Bible inter information class. My husband, um, Larry's work, demands him to be gone for a full week, sometimes two, sometimes three, it just dep depends. And then he's home, we come to church together, we go to the class together, we fully enjoy it. So for me, as a believer in God my entire life, I necessarily hadn't my whole life taken steps, right, to be closer to Jesus, but I knew now it, it was the right time. I've enjoyed the class so, so, so much. Mr. Bigelow has been amazing. I'm excited to go to my class and, you know, and then you have church at, you know, so it's, it's a great morning. It gives me um, peace knowing that God is in control, especially of what's going on in the world. I'm not afraid, really, you know. When I knew I could go and talk to Mr. Bigelow to have some sort of support and to pray with, with somebody, I took full advantage. My mother had started having issues with her back. They didn't know really why, and it, it, she, was, she was diagnosed with bone cancer. And um, I was afraid to tell the kids. So and that's what he did, you know, he gave, me, he gave me the comfort that I needed and more the strength, really. And the prayers have, have have tremendously, you know, been a blessing for us. It just really gives me just comfort. Wrigley has changed completely from the child that she was when she first walked into St. Matthew's. She's, you know, my confident, sweet, loving child again, you know, who doesn't shake every morning before she goes into school. She's made new friends, you know, within a short, such a short period of time. And I do really believe that it's how these children are raised, who they're raised by, right? And what they are taught. And it was amazing for my children to come home to me and say, Mommy, they talk about Jesus like we do. So next year, we've decided and such a blessing for my husband to send her to Lakeside and she's thrilled about it. Ever since my mom and cancer, everything else really doesn't matter, right? Like you really truly, my life is amazing and God did this, God put me here. I truly believe that.